everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Abhilasha Singh and I bring to you easy breezy makeup tutorials. Today I will do a makeover on my beautiful Hispanic Mexican client and turn her into an Indian beauty. So without much ado, let's begin. Starting my makeup with this face tightening mask by Glam Glow to add a little more extra glow to her already beautiful skin. The next step is always using a toner but I'm using a rose water instead because she has sensitive skin. After I have sprayed the rose water, I'm going to use this serum. I'm going to list all the products in the description box below. After the serum comes the moisturizer and this is a beautiful Thalgo moisturizer for dry skin. Lips are extremely important and here is a lip balm by Bite Beauty and I like using a brush to apply the same. The next step is eyebrows and we are going to fill as much as needed. She already has dark and thick eyebrows and I'm going to shape them and fill them as much as required. You can always go ahead and add more later if you need. I'm taking my Shape Tape Concealer in shade Light Medium and I'm going to cover her eyelids and enhance under the brow bone. After we have set the concealer on the eyelid, I'm going to use this beautiful paint pot in Indian Wood by MAC Cosmetics. Please do find all the details of the products in the description box below. I use a flat pan shadow brush so it covers larger area because we need this eyeshadow all over the eyelid. And a paint pot has to be worked very quickly. The next step being I'm going to take this Becca highlighter and I'm going to use it as an eyeshadow base. They just pop the eye and it's such a beautiful shade in champagne pop. Just very lightly all over the eyelid. Once I have evenly spread the liquid illuminator on the eyelid, I'm going to take my Huda Beauty Palette in Desert Dusk and use Transition Shade right here. Transition Shades actually create a very beautiful eye shape and they also do not make the eye makeup look intense. Let's go ahead and use a liquid eyeliner. It's so much fun to have such amazing, beautiful and fun clients. Liquid eyeliner is something you need a lot of practice with, but it is one of the most easiest ways of creating a pink eyeliner.
primer. It's a mattifying primer for her pores because she has combination skin of dry and oily. So I'm using this wherever I would expect the oil patches to come. I'm using this orange corrector by Bobby Brown. It's a very beautiful serum based corrector. And I'm going to cover all the spots that are visible. Bobby Brown corrector in peach. And with the brush, I'm going to quickly blend it all into the skin. When you're around the eye area, just be careful because it's a very soft and delicate area. So very lightly, you need to just brush it around the eye. Once we apply it, we will go ahead and smudge it out with a very fine brush. Let's go ahead and use the Coral Obsession palette by Huda Beauty and we will use the brown color to smudge the lower waterline and make it a little more softer. We'd already smudged the black pencil, but the brown always adds a little glamour factor when you are creating these beautiful winged eyeliner eye makeups. Here we have both the eyes so beautifully done and I'm still smudging the waterline and making it softer. Adding mascara always finishes a beautiful eye makeup. I'm using a waterproof Estee Lauder mascara on her lower lash line. I'm using the Hula bronzer to just add a little warmth to her face. I love how the whole foundation has set on her and how the eye makeup is making her look so beautiful and has given her such an amazing Indian touch. Nobody would ever know she's a Hispanic by origin. I'm going to take this beautiful pencil by MAC Cosmetics in SOAR, S-O-A-R. Again, it's mentioned in the comments below. And she's happy with the look that I can see for sure. Isn't she looking already so beautiful and so Indian? 
This is a Natasha Moore liquid lipstick. And I'm just gonna top off the lip pencil with this amazing, beautiful liquid lipstick to give her makeup a soft glam glow. Very carefully, I'm gonna line the lips with the liquid lipstick. And also highlight her cupid's bow with the same liquid lipstick. This is a Becca Illuminator in Champagne Pop. I'm gonna go ahead and add that in the highlight spots all over her face. There it is, the complete look. Isn't she gorgeous? It doesn't matter which country you belong to. Women are women and beauty is beauty. Uh, if you like this video, please do like, share and subscribe to the video. And I will see you next Tuesday again with a very quick and easy tutorial.